Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are fascinated by trains and technology or just want to learn how we are speeding into the future, stay tuned because this is going to be a ride you don't want to miss. BEML Bangalore Rail Coach Complex will build the country's first indigenously designed and manufactured high speed train with a test speed of 280 km per hour. BEML has been awarded a contract valued at nearly 867 crore by Integral Coach Factory Chennai for the design, manufacture and commissioning of two high-speed train sets, each comprising eight cars. The price of each car is nearly 28 crores, which includes design cost, one-time development cost, non-recurring charges, one-time cost towards jigs, fixture, toolings and test facilities which will be utilized for all future high-speed rail projects in India. After negotiations to procure Japanese bullet trains failed, the railway set out to build its own high-speed train. On June 6th of this year, the railway ministry asked ICF to build two train sets that can go up to the speed of 250 km per hour. ICF floated a tender for trains, but it is not immediately clear if the trains developed by BEML will be used for Mumbai Ahmedabad high speed rail corridor. This project marks significant milestone in India's high speed rail journey and will see the first indigenously designed and manufactured train sets with a test speed of 280 km per hour and operational speed of 250 km per hour. The new high speed train will be based out of self propelled electric multiple unit. But few of the major challenges we can expect in such high speed train compared to existing Vande Bharat train are the catenary system needs to be mechanically more robust to avoid vibrations and electrically it should be efficient in receiving power without arcing. The converter system needs to be more robust and efficient for high speed operations. The traction system need to be more reliable. Boogie and suspension need to be relooked to have a better ride experience for passengers. Safety system and collision detection system need to be fast acting. Since the train is operating at a high speed, the air intake of the cooling system need to be looked. Although the nose cone design of the train won't be so important unless the train is meant to travel in and out of tunnels multiple times. The train coming out of a tunnel creates a sonic boom which will be a nuisance for local residents. Some of the features which general public will experience apart from the high speed travel are the fully air conditioned chair car configuration, the reclining and rotatable seats, special provision for the passengers with restricted mobility and onboard infotainment systems. All in all, it will be really interesting to find how the new high speed rail will be designed, its challenges and how the team in Indian Railway will overcome the same. The train sets will be built at BML Bangalore Rail Coach Complex and are scheduled for delivery by the end of 2026. So there you have it. BML along with ICF is setting the tracks for India's high speed rail future and it's exciting to think about what that means for the travel and connectivity in our country. Thanks for joining me today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button Share your thoughts in the comment section and subscribe for more amazing content. Let's keep riding towards the future together. Thank you.